Ah, happy beautiful Christmas. The sky is blue, the sky is brown, the sun is wise, and the snowman and the slow. And we really happy to enjoy the mousy pushy with the stars, and it has a bowl of fish, and it has a radio tape for the stories. And it made some drawings here, look at the pictures, and we're gonna set with father and me, and buy our old toys, and you know, look at stuff of uh, things, I'm gonna play fun with toys, and a uh, creepy doorway. Oh, okay, oh, exactly. Hello everyone, welcome to Fossey Nights. Fossey Night is a always a new day, is a Boogeyman or Boogeyman 2 or the mystery of a Boogeyman 3. I always say exactly as well. I hope it's come out. Anyways, we have Wangos, Langos in the Christmas Center. You're here along with me. So, we have Teddy Bear. Teddy Bear is my favorite. Oh, wait. Teddy Bear is my favorite. Oh, look at the coat. I wear the raincoat. I uh, guess it's the name 6. Oh, wait. Look at the Fossey. It has the Lonely 2. Good, the Fossey. Oh, night. Oh, this must be the door. Let's go to the new game. New game for Xenda. Oh, wait. What would like to be? Boy or the girl? Hmm. What's the second part? Which one you choose, guys? First of all, we can choose a male or female. Maybe I could just... Boy first. That way I'm a boy. I am a smart one. Or the pink slime join us into the party. Yay! Okay, let's begin. Oh, you can sure press E. I didn't know it. Alright. Oh, put the stuff in the store, man. We can build. Alright. Grab this one. And we can make this Christmas for light cartoons. That's right. Until not yet. Alright. What am I going to do? Oh, carrots! Just we need carrots. And some nose. Okay, what's next here? Oh, those rocks! Oh, oh, cornerstone, of course. Add those eyes, add those buttons. Oh, the, oh, in my clothes, in my scarf. There we go, the scarf looks like a, uh, uh, I don't know, it looks like a town. Oh! There's a swing set, there's a head, okay, I'll take that, will you? Okay, good, I'll take this head, will you? Okay, put the head for the Christmas to tell the night. There we go, look at that, looks beautiful. And we need to add some Tweety skits, those sticks right there on the ground, so let's grab that stick. Okay, grab the sticks right here, so we're going to do that. Okay, put the sticks on his rep, rep arm, and the uh, other rep. Left, left, uh, left arm. Oh, wait, exactly. Okay, hold still, Sticky. I get you for this. Oh, my. Add his left arm. There we go. What's done? It looks brand new. It seems done. Well done. Now let's go outside. Let's take us home. Oh, wake up! Oh! Oh, is man died already? Oh man, maybe next time I have fun! Oh, we have Mousy Pushy with- 
Don't up. stay up too late, okay? You've got your first day at school tomorrow. And no listening to those horror stories anymore. You know they give you nightmares. Sweet dreams. Love you. Uh, happy... Happy, happy, good luck! Okay, goodbye! Good night, Mom. Okay, good night, Mom, I guess. Oh, what's those? Let's... Okay, let's take it. Oh! Okay. I uh, wonder they said. Oh yeah. Okay, story time. I handed my story to the tape. Oh, okay, yeah, sure. What that? The tape recorder. It's a dodge shape to the head. So I need a quarter of that. Is that better, guys? Okay, it's good. Okay, story time. I handed my story tape around my room to stop and my mom find them. I'm not sleeping yet. I must find them and play them in my tape player. I won't have time to listen to them again. I have five tapes. Oh, we need to collect those tapes, I guess. So we need to find those tapes, I guess. So we can use a nice a mouse cursor. Nice. Oh, we need a tape. No one hitting a find my tape. Oh yeah. Open the closet. Maybe they're hidden in the tape. Okay, just move. Okay, just move. Okay, there we go. Oh! Hado? Who? What? Oh, Hado there. I guess so. Where's the tape? It's hard to find tape. Hmm. Is it inside my own batteries? Oh, uh, oh, in the drawer, of course. Okay, uh, I need to hold stair mouse. Okay, grab the drawer. Oh, there we go. Oh, there's a tape. Okay, there's a tape. It's hard to do stuff, guys. It's hard to do, but I can't grab the tape. That's all right. It's a thing. That's all right. Okay, grab that tape. Ugh. I, I, I can't grab the tape. Oh yeah, I need to hold first. I forgot that. Yep. Grab this tape. Yeah, we grab the tape and put this scroll here. There we go. Frosty night. Chapter 1 Welcome, children, to a wonderful, magical, yet grisly story that old Saint Nicholas never wanted you to know. This story takes us back a long, long time ago, when old Nicholas still had flecks of ginger in his beard. We'll just call him by what everyone today know him as, Santa. Santa! We will start from the very beginning, when Santa was still scouring the world for the perfect place to build his workshop. Ooh. He found none better than the North Pole, where magic seeped readily from the Earth. So much magic was there that Santa learned to use the magic in ways he had never dreamt. Really? His body no longer grew old. Really? With slow time around him to a near complete stop, and as long as he gathered enough magic, he knew he could travel the world in what to us was a single day. Wow! Even slowing time as he could, Santa quickly realized to make enough toys for every child in the world would take him far too long. Yes. So Santa placed his hands into the snow and called to Mother Nature herself for help. Yep. Mother yeah, Nature was gentle, as she was wild. She saw the kindness in Santa's heart and agreed to help by melding Santa's magic and Mother Nature's spirit into the snow itself. Snow? The first of the snowmen bubbled up from the ground like liquid snow. Really? Yet unmoving and lifeless, just as the snowmen we know today, Mother Nature seemed to pause before then placing a carrot for its nose. Hey, I did. You see, everything that is alive requires a small uh, amount of life to begin with. The acorn for the oak tree, the egg for the red robin, and the love of a mother and father for humanity. Yes! The carrot twitched, and ever so slowly, eyes within the sphere of snow began to appear and opened for the first time. Santa slanted his head to the side in a curious thinking gaze as he took off his scarf and hat and placed it upon the snowman. Taking a step back, he looked again and smiled. Smile, the snowman I smiled back, 
Okay. The Santa, the father, and Mother Nature as the mother. The snowman were all too happy to help Santa build his workshop and all the toys I thought for every snowman. child in the world. What? Snowman just himself? He's come to life? I can't believe this. That's a good story, right? Okay, guys, I, I grabbed the flashlight, so it's useful for that. We got a flashlight. Okay, so you need to find the other tape. Oh, there's a tape. Okay, grab that tape right here. Okay, grab the tape. Uh, do I post me to click on you, please? I. Okay. I grab. Okay, I grab the tape. Good. Okay, that was the second tape. Chapter 2 Many years had passed, and children throughout the world had Christmas within their hearts. Santa had delivered toys year after year to the children of the world, and the world was a better place for it. However, there were children who were not happy with Santa's toys alone, and really? demanded more and more. The parents of many of these children succumbed to their child's wishes and began to buy more and more as each year passed. Wow! Each year more and more trees were getting cut down, toy factories could not keep up with the demand, and forests were not being replanted and regrown as Santa did with his magic. Yeah? Mother Nature watched as the birds... Squirrels, deer, bears, and countless more of her children were left homeless Hopeless. and died. Mother Nature once saw humanity as her children, but each year as the destruction for toys carried on, she became more and more furious. Oh. Santa understood Mother Nature's anger and tried to make amends by creating the naughty list. Any child who was undeserving would not receive Santa's toys, and the spare magic from making those toys would be given to the forests of the planet to help grow and recover. Mother Nature was happy for a time, until even this did not offset humanity's greed. Humans, now with great machines, powered from the fossils of her most ancient children, began to pollute the air, water, the earth, Forests vanished before her eyes, and entire species began to die. Oh! Mother Nature wept for many years, hoping humanity would hear her and stop the pain they were causing. Her cries were drowned out by the drills boring into the planet, the saws biting into the trees, oh. and the roaring of flames in engines. Oh! The pain turned to anger, <gasps> and the anger to fury. Santa was helpless as Mother Nature's suffering began to warp the minds of the snowmen. One by one, they stopped working on toys and slowly but surely faded into the distance as they left the workshop behind. Santa eventually found the elves high up in the mountains that were glad to be of help to Santa. However, our story is with the snowmen. And not Santa. Okay, so that's the second one tape. I guess so I go find the uh... Okay, I need to find the other tape. I guess so. Okay guys, on the next one, this tape I found this is kinda easy to know. Alright, this one's due. Okay, let's grab this one. Chapter 3 John had just gotten home from school. He quickly grew excited as he spotted the snowman outside his bedroom window. John's dad often made him surprises, and he quickly ran out to decorate the snowman. John used his favorite scarf and hat, and found the shiniest rocks he could for the buttons. John was very proud of his decorations, and soon it was time for him to go to bed. Looking out the window, he smiled at the snowman as his eyes slowly began to close. John awoke 
with a chill in the air wow. and snow on his bed. He opened his eyes to see the window was wide open. Uh -huh. Confused and sleepy, he got up and closed the window. As he looked out, however, he noticed the snowman's hat was missing. What? It must have blown off in the wind, he thought. Upon getting back into bed, he found the hat on top of his covers. He stopped and thought for a moment. His mom must have taken it off and put it there for him. After all, he no longer had a hat to wear for school tomorrow. And wow. It was very cold outside in the mornings. It does. The next day, John returned again from school, and a second snowman was right next to the first. He couldn't believe it. His dad had built him a second. He went into the closet and found his box of old warm clothes, hats and scarves, too tattered to wear, but sentimental enough to keep. John decorated the second, and again smiled with pride, as it almost seemed like the snowman smiled back at him. A trick of the imagination. And John thought how cool it would be if snowmen really were alive. Wow. That's enough tape for that. And there is the tape right here. Okay, grab that tape. No, that, that one. I, I, I can't grab. There it goes. There, oh, finally, I can't grab the tape. Uh, did I drop the tape? Or is break the tape? Okay, I guess I'm gonna break the tape again. Great. Um, um, I got disappointed, guys. Uh, sorry about the tape, so I'm sure it gets started first. I forgot that. Okay, what's your just reading? Acting plans. Before each night, before eight or nights, I sure search for useful things and put them with a day well hi the warehouse. Be best to write the point to the start of the night. Okay, so I set the tape guys and we got flashlight. That way it's never useful. What did you get start tonight? Alright, so... Did I see the window? I guess so. We're gonna start the night. Sleep! Okay, so... We gotta start the night one, and the, uh, the closet is open. Yep, I kinda totally is to start the night. So... Uh, that's disappointed. Okay, okay, okay. We will survive, guys. We will survive through the night. It's hell. One a.m. Okay, one a.m. You know, hopefully, it just show up the uh, those spooky men or swarm men. Uh, the both at the same time. They are at the same time. It's almost like almost ties up so he show us too easy. Do I hear dripping? Ah! So man! Ah! Do I see that? I didn't suspect that! That woman is alive! I didn't know is he there. He tried to kill me. Why he in the, enter the closet? Uh, why the windows open? Why the door? Why the windows open? Why? Should I? Dear, I don't want to do that. If I hear sounds come from, I will use that blower to rapid the snowman melting in my house. Yeah, the melt in the house, right? Alright, they need to keep it survive. Hey <laughs> hey. Okay, it's till noon. Oh, 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 oh hopefully it will show up in the night. Okay. What time is it? It's almost 3 a.m. That's too easy. 
Nothing in the first night. We will survive. Hopefully. We just sit there, just do nothing. Oh well, that's not fun. Even not scary at all. I hear the I hear the window. I the sounds come from the wind. <laughs> Stop! <sighs> I don't like those toys. You just shut the box. Oh, I got flashlight. Be useful. Keep it melt. Oh. Oh, I can't pick up stuff. How? How? How I could do that? Oh, I go pet the bed. That's too easy. I know how to. Ah! That's woman's. All right. That's I hear a call from the. All right. So you can use the bed. Why there's a train is move? It's never on? Did the toys come to life? Oh dear, I just see everything. What just go on? Oh dear. And why the lights turn off? Why the lights turn off? Oh dear. You can see that I use a poly light. I think it's still the way away here in my house. I got beam in here. I think keep it melting. This one may die. It just start to melt. If we start for swimming, you get more minions of them. Horror games that are exactly haunting us. Oh dear. Hopefully I can share tell like it's a quick. Too easy. <laughs> Oh, oh, I did? Oh, it's just 6 a.m. Oh, yeah, I guess I won. Yippee, I guess I won. Yay. Look, it tells it on my time clock. Nice. Oh, what's the next swole man? Oh, dear. Look at his eyes. Oh, his blue eyes. Oh, he's starting to move. Oh dear! Oh, okay, we're starting the night. What's on my list? Okay. Okay, what's on my list? Sure work for things that make a noise and try to put them back in place that where alarms to the swarm is coming from. We need to get back into the bed when I finish. Oh, that's I drawing of course. That's too easy. Teddy bear, squeaky. Oh, okay, we need to fight teddy bear. Oh, teddy bear is gonna be under my bed. Oh, guess not. Where is the teddy bear? Is it in there? Teddy bear. Is that you, teddy bear? Did I hear it open? Oh, he keeps saying hello. All right, where is the teddy bear? Teddy bear, where are you? I need to find you. Is it there? Oh, teddy bear! Just we need teddy bear! Nice to meet you, teddy bear. I know we miss you. Uh, place it a toy. Oh, I place it there on the ground. Of course, it's squeaky. The squeaky noise. Okay, that's done. What's on my list? I guess we're done. Hopefully, I'll get this out to check. Just checking, make sure just in case. Uh, everything looks okay. Okay, we done that one. We'll check here. Oh, bells! Okay, I need to grab bells. I sure do. Okay, grab that bell. I need to grab. Oh, still bell. I need to grab. There we go. Grab the bell. Okay, it's useful for that bell. 
be useful. We got a bell here, so... Oh, useful for that. Good. Good to know. Too easy. So we use a bell to ring. Annoy us. Too easy. Now what's the next? Let's check it right here. Maybe this day there. Huh. Okay. Oh, just we need. Okay, grab that. Grab that. Okay, now hold still. Just we need this. Jingle sound. Which one I put there, guys? I don't know which I put. Hmm. Maybe it's come from in this door? Uh, which one? Oh! I put the closet so he make it. Okay. Too easy! Okay, that's too easy. Oh, my power drain! Oh dear, my power drain. Okay, 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 okay. Oh yeah, we need a. Oh, okay, we need a plan. We need a plan. Okay, guys, maybe I'm done. So I have to go back to sleep. Alright! Uh, back to sleep. Alright, night two! Okay, guys, it shows night two. That's too easy. There's a barrel. Okay, there's a closet, and there's. Oh, there's a picture on this woman. That's new. Okay, guys, this is a plan. The plan works as a tiny bear squeaky. I can use this one to gnaw that. It's almost 2 a.m. My full pit, my full power with my flashlight and my boom. I hear sounds. Ah! Go away, woman! I hear the bell. Nice work. That's a work of plan. Too easy. Night night too easy. That's too easy. Okay, okay, okay. Let's just calm myself. Oh, wait, I just a only little lonely boy because why the mom is gone? I mean, sure the dad is gone too. He sure told me. Oh wait, I hope the parents are right. I only one child. Hopefully, you hear the bell sound. Uh, I hear it out. Go away, Swordman. Wherever you are. Do I hear sound? Maybe it's just a stick in a tree, that's all. Don't think I play off me. I be brave childhood. I hear sounds. Speaky toys with a teddy bear. Oh boy. Okay. Okay, I don't hear sounds come from anywhere. Or the bells. Open the doors open. Oh the uh, the windows open. Oh dear. The, uh, oh, the window's open. Okay, okay, we need to use this to protect myself. Okay, clearly, they're in the closet. Quickly, the door's in there. And... Ah! Go away! Yes, we melt swimming. Too easy. What? Did I glitch? Guess not. <laughs> hey, hey, this is too easy to me. Too easy! Okay, 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 I need to calm myself again. <laughs> I don't just a full ration. Light taper? I guess so. Wait. Oh, wait, it's only kids. It's not for kids. Kids! It's for dangerous! This place is a light. It's the darkest. Alright. Oh, good! The windows alive! Good! Because the windows come out, and I'm gonna use a blast. Blaster is a little light. Hey, it's funny. Okay, did I move something? Right here. Something. Okay. Something. 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 Something.
Look over here. Hear sound. Those two sounds come from easy way to directions. No matter what. Oh, just a deer. I hear sound. Ah, that's useful. Did the lights to Oh, good. Oh, no. The winter. Oh, dear. The storm still is slow. Did the doors open? Oh, dear. Shut the door. Okay, we shut the door just like ta uh, just like Tattie Tail. You know the Tattie Tail would just shut the door. Feel like it. Oh dear! The cover is slow. The slow on the top of the roof. Hopefully, I didn't get the creature. Creature. Even creature. Hopefully I go end this video right here guys, if you like this, it's a Pokemon, or it's, uh, Bossy Nights. Wow, that's a big storm. You know that. How liar is it get? I close the door. What are they doing? Close that door. Ah, 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 ah. ah yes, I did it. Not choo choo train. They got no time for a choo choo train. What time is it? I can't tell noon. Okay. It tells 3 a.m., guys. It shows my 3 a.m. Okay, that's a Tales 3 l before, right? Toka, Toka, Toka. Oh wait, we're gonna use- I don't know what use for a flashlight, so I can use for that later. This is a night. You know, spooky. The, uh, the light turns broken. <laughs> yes! We did it! We passed the night! Woohoo! Yeah! Ho -ho! We passed a six hours night! Ho ho ho! Oh, what's the next? All oh, those quarters! Oh dear, he's a knit that knitted one. Oh, this is crazy. They crow in it too. They crow. He's small. He's a small. Oh, I can not tell it. Oh, night three. Oh, those little guys up there in the roof inside the fence. Oh dear, this is a whole nightmare directions. And you gotta tell with the night three. Did it cross it? Oh dear, not the window. I hope the other guy's up there. I keep on you, the other guy. I knew it, you there. Where are you going? I use a broom. I use a flashlight. Easy. Okay, I'll open the. Ah! Ah! Get away! Oh dear! That's terrifying. That'll be easy nights, guys. I mean, let me know in the comments. If it's totally easy night one through three, I guess, so I can move on the next night. Sweet. Oh, there's a picture of art. Sweet. I like his art. Did it, did it, did they move? So I hear something. No! The window's open. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I uh, no. Oh dear. The crawlies. Whoa! 